YouTubers, it's Magic the Gathering UK here again. And today we are finishing off our Modern Masters 2017 edition booster box. Two more packs, last two. This box has been fairly bad. We've got a couple of really nice cards though, so it's not all bad. It's not all bad. It kind of kind of redeemed itself a little bit, let's say. But no good foils, unfortunately. But um, yeah, we've still got two packs. Could still get another Fetch Land or Blood Moon or Damnation or... Any number of bulk rares that we still haven't got. So let's, uh, let's find out. Last two packs. We could get another Mythic, of course. That doesn't always mean it's a good thing. Because there are several Mythics in this set not worth anything. More than several, in fact. So yeah, 70% of the Mythics are bad in this set. Gruul Gilgate. A Mist Raven. Augusbury or Algusbury? I think it's Alga probably. Dregscape Zombie. Explore. What are we exploring? Crippling Chill. Diner Charge. Rakdos Guildgate. Scourge Devil. Youthful Knight. Uh, first uncommon is a Golgari Germination. I don't think we've had that one yet. Unflinching Courage is the second uncommon. So no good uncommons yet. And it's good as they So no good uncommons in the second to last pack. And the bulk rare. Please don't be red. <laughs> or black. Oh no. It's a mythic. Yeah, it's terrible. It's Domri Raid. That's a really bad mythic. I don't know how much he's worth. I, he's one of the worst mythics in the set. Uh, he is three dollars. It's better than not getting him at all, though. <laughs> well, I'd rather have got a Blood Moon. Oh yeah, but it's so bad. And the foil. That's red. Blood Moon. It always red. Foil Blood Moon. Scourge Devil. It's common. Lame. Ugh, man, this box. And a soldier token. We got one of the six soldier tokens though. Why is he sick? The art's pretty cool. Yeah. And the final pack. We've got two mythics in the end. Which is kind of okay, I guess. Acceptable. Except one of them was the worst mythic near enough. Actually, it's not strictly true. There are a few worse ones than that, but it's definitely in the lower, lower echelon. The last packet. The last pack. Can we get a, uh, a fetch land? A one fetch land box is pretty bad. Average is two to three a box. Probably going to be another junk rare, let's be honest. There's plenty of them in the set, so we haven't hit a lot of them yet. Din Rover Horror. Sky Knight Legionnaire. Grizzly Spectacle. Grixis Slave Driver. I don't think we've had that one at all, actually. Maybe we have. Seal of Primordium. Seagate Oracle. Golgari Guildgate. Golgari Rotworm. It's quite cool that those two went together. Hanweir Lancer. Lone Missionary. Intangible Virtue is the first one called. We've not had that one yet. It's kind of a cool card. Gaia's Anthem. I don't know if we've had that one yet or not either. I don't recognise it. Getting a bunch of different cards here at least. Even if they're not great. Ooh, oh, Flicker Wisp again. Another one we didn't have, I don't think. That was an interesting last pack for uncommons. Not worth anything, but That's Flicker Wisp isn't too bad. Please don't be red. And the bulk rare to end the box. Please don't be red. It's white. Oh god, that's just that's even worse than red. There's no good white white rares in this set. So a terrible pack to end on. Could be Ranger of Eos, could be Stony Silence. It's a Blade Splicer. Even worse than those two I just mentioned. It's worthless, completely worthless. And the rare, I mean foil. Not that it matters at this point, it's pretty dire. Blue, Snapcaster Mage. Mystical Teachings, wow. Okay, well, that was literally awful. This box was diabolical, to say the least. We got about $180 worth of value. 
and a giant warrior token. This box was <laughs> the worst box. We got one card worth money, and that saved the whole box. Two, in fact. Uh, and the rest was just junk. The whole box was junk. So yeah, there we go. That wraps up our... I could do a sum up, but it's really not worth it. This box was completely worthless. We got a Blade Splicer. We got a Domri Raid. Terrible, terrible mythic. We got a Hell Rider. Ether Mage's Touch. Tarmogoyf, the only expensive card we got, I suppose. Damp Damping Matrix. Scalding Tarm, the only other good rare we got. Mind Shatter. Falcon Wrath Aristocrat. Basilisk Collar. Goblin Guide, that one's fairly decent. Call of the Herd. Phantasmal Image. Wart the Raid Mother. Mizium Mortars. Evil Twin. Ulvenwald Tracker. Deadeye Navigator. Extractor Demon. Restoration Angel. Seance. Sever the Bloodline, and Zur the Enchanter, so, honestly, a, if it wasn't for the Tarmogoyf, this box would have been the worst box of Modern Masters you could get. There you are, that wraps it up, hope you enjoyed the series, hope you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up button if you did, subscribe to the channel, plenty more Magic the Gathering goodness, leave some comments below, let me know how mad you would have been with this box, because I'm pretty disappointed. Um, I never get good boxes, so I don't know what to expect anymore, but, uh, I was really hoping that we'd get at least two fetches to even out a little bit, but it's just all the bulk rares, like no good rares, it's unbelievable. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you again very soon, bye bye